Alright, so I just powered on the PS4. This is the very first screen that you get. So it's asking you to plug in the USB cable from the PS4 to the controller. Then press the button for PS. There it is. So when I plugged it in, the little light came on here. So we're gonna go ahead and do that now. What language? English. Set up internet connection. Alright, and since I have my Ethernet modem connection right next to my PS4, I'm going to use the LAN cable. So I went ahead and connected the LAN, LAN cable. Now I just detected that the uh, camera is not connected. I don't own one yet, so we're going to go ahead and skip that for now. Um, uh, time, we are definitely not anywhere near Mexico City, so let's do this. I'm shooting this video from California, by the way, so that'll be Pacific time. And today's date, there's 11-15-2013, yeah. launch day for the PS4, yeah, 9.46, that's correct. Should I accept? Of course, we have no choice. Setup is complete. Let's start it now. So that's the new menu. Let's find out what's new. Yep, I was afraid of this, but yeah, we're going to have to update this firmware. I'll go ahead and do it now, and I'll let you guys watch for the next 10 minutes while this updates. No, I'm just joking. Go ahead and pause it right now. So, just so you have an idea, um, I've been waiting for at least... A minute now and it's at 11 percent so it shouldn't take too long all right so roughly four to five minutes and uh, ps4 is uh, gonna go ahead and shut off and restart automatically and we'll wait and see what happens right now all right so you'll see this light go from white to blue Rebooting. Now it looks like we gotta wait some more. So, total time so far since it asked for the uh, system update, it has been about seven minutes now. All right, so there it is. Seven or eight minutes later. Looks like it's about to uh, start up now. Yep, there it is. Press the PS button. Yeah, yeah, go ahead and push it. All right, what is it asking us to do? All right, who is using this controller? Obviously, I am, so I'm going to put my name on there right now. So as soon as you push the PS button, it takes you to this menu here. So I'm going to go ahead and um, sign up for this. All right, so to ask for a whole bunch of information in regards to your name, uh, what city you live in, a whole bunch of stuff. So that took a good five minutes. 
And now it's asking me if I want to log in with Facebook to use my um, Facebook picture and real name when I play games. I did not want that to happen, so I hit no. And it took me to this screen. And like I said, I'm not planning on sharing my Facebook information right now at this minute, so we're going to do this later. Now, should we join PlayStation Plus? Of course. This is where this comes into play. There at the bottom, there's a code which we can use to get a free 3D trial. We're gonna try it out right now and go from there. All right, so there's a box. It asks to enter your code, so I went ahead and put it in there. It's a 12-digit code found at the bottom part of that uh, little page here that's included with the system when you buy it. And there it is, confirmation. 30-day trial. It's been accepted for one item, so we're going to go ahead and redeem that. Now it's asking for credit card information, so let me uh, grab my wallet and I'll be right back. Alright, so it won't allow you to get the 30 day trial if um, unless you enter your credit card information. So I went ahead and did that right now and now it says it's uh, successfully added, so we're going to hit OK. Uh, we need to subscribe to the service. Yes, yes, yes. Go ahead and do automatic withdraw from my account. Right after that, you get the thanks for joining. Press OK. Promotion code has been redeemed. OK. Do you want to activate this system as your primary PS4? Yes. Your PSN sign-in information has been saved. Hit OK. And looks like we're done setting up the PlayStation. So now, um, why don't you uh, show them what we have here. So you got the library, internet browser, live from PlayStation, the playroom, music unlimited, video unlimited, TV and video, and what's new? So why don't you uh, let's ch let's check out the uh, what's new information down below. So go ahead and click on that, and it looks like it's gonna give us a little welcome video or something like that. Let's see what it says. Oh yeah. Let's watch yeah. that again. Like this. No, I'm playing. All right, let's go back to the uh, main menu. Like All right, go up. Go to the right. TV and video. I do have a Netflix, Instant, Redbox, Amazon, Hulu, Voodoo, Crackle. Um, you have TV. I, yep. So I think the only one I'm going to use is just Crackle, Hulu Plus, and probably Netflix. What about Voodoo? Uh, yeah, we have a couple of movies on Voodoo too, so we'll, we'll activate that later. Go, go up again. Go to the right. Videos Unlimited. Should we sign up for this? Um, yeah, it comes with the 30-day um, trial. So we'll go ahead and activate, activate that later. Uh, go back up. 
uh, to the right. Music Unlimited, we'll do that too later on. Playroom. Live from PlayStation. Why don't you go to Live from PlayStation and see what's what's happening right now. Press. Check out interesting and helpful broadcasts around the world. Yeah, I hit OK. What's going on right now? Wow. Look at that. Go to the right. Just scroll through a whole bunch of videos and uh, see what people are doing. Go down. Yep, looks like everybody's playing except us. So let's get this thing going. Um, the video game we're, gonna, we're about to play which is probably going to be Need for Speed. So let's go ahead and open that up right now. All right, so that's your web browser. And uh, that concludes this video on setup of the PS4. Uh, stay tuned uh, for more videos on gameplay. Thanks for watching this video.